Yeah, yeah, I, I will knew say Wii this. U was going to be no, awesome. No, I can't even say this. I can't even say that if I was to add a seventh topic that the Wii U wouldn't win again because the last thing that we could possibly talk about is graphics and resolution. Should I add it? Should we debate? Let's here's my, I, don't, I, don't, I don't say we add it as an extra topic. Let's do a real quick but run. But here's my issue. Go for it. What's... PlayStation been pushing 60 frames per second, 60 frames per second, 60 frames per second. Here's the order 1886, 30 frames per second because we don't need the whole 60 because it works out as a cinematic experience. I know better than anybody that that game works out as a cinematic freaking experience. But I'm sure it looks great. It does. I'm sure it does. No, but they've been beating you over the head with the 60 frames per second stick. I'm going to bring just up their for biggest I'm game gonna, just before for saying What would you give a number one to that? Okay. The beast, what system gets the okay. best resolution? The reason why, and I'm only going to bring best this up. looking game. The only reason I'm going to bring this up real quick is because, you know that new Battlefield that comes out next week? That uh, hardline? Yeah. They announced the specs. At 980p, it will run on the PS4. 720 on the Xbox One. And I, told, I brought this to you the other day. Xbox One is holding the PS4 back. Find out when you make games for both consoles, it's holding it back because it has the ability to pull 60 frames a second at 1080p. The Xbox, they say it can do it, but to be fair. Do you really want to hear a rocket launch in your living room? For me, <laughs> here's the here's graphic the li- resolution there wise, go. I'm going for PS4. Okay, so you say PS4 has the best graphics on the market right now. Yes, then it would be. You know, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna do. It. I, I may get it shit for. It. I'm gonna go for it. Xbox One next. Okay. Wii U has good graphics. You go now. They did. They finally upgraded from the Wii. Obviously. It, okay. I've seen Mario Kart 8. Looks fantastic. I've seen Hyrule <laughs> Warriors. Looks fantastic. I've the new Mario Party is coming out. It's gonna look great. I know, but the Wii U still is behind with that with the other consoles because, like he was saying, they keep pushing. And pushing for these resolutions and stuff. The PS4 can handle it. The PS4 is very powerful. A lot of people will bitch. Just to fight with you real quick. Here's... Now, I'm not... I'm not. I'm, this is this is devil's advocate, advocate, but I really want you to think about this. Okay. While you push and push and push these boundaries, and you want so bad for your system to look so good, you give me games like... I don't know. Assassin's Creed. Unity. Where they don't. No, no. This is fair, Shane. Yeah. No matter. How Do you remember around the creepy room. skeleton face person in the in all the videos? We're Eyeballs. Seeing? Yeah. You're, pushing, ball. you're trying to push the limits. Now, to be fair, I never got that glitch. Okay. But Doesn't matter. But, but, but I don't know. I've seen it. You're trying to push the limits, and you're trying to make these games look so unbelievable. You're going to have rushing road bumps. And your games your games are not hitting 1080p because you want the 60 frames so damn bad. Now, I oppose something crazy to you. If you stayed within the confines and limits of what your system can do and did it well, When's the last games, time you saw creepy floating eyeballs that weren't an enemy in the Zelda <laughs> game? Let me ask you this. Uh, okay, I would How be- many Wii U games are launching first party that are not 1080p? Name one. And while you're at it, name one that runs at 30 frames a second. I'll go ahead and give my opinions on graphics. Name one. <laughs> For me... Mario Kart? For me, I would put PS4 first, but I would put Wii U second. And this is just my opinion. Okay. Wii U second, and Xbox One third. Here's my opinion on that, alright? I am going to say that for stability reasons, I think the Wii U wins. Yes, the PlayStation 4 looks better. It has the capability to look better. But my my whole argument is I don't have to see these bugs and glitches in a Nintendo game I'll give you that. anywhere near as often. Shigeru Miyamoto quoted word for word, a delayed game will eventually be great, but a rushed game 
will forever be bad. Makes a lot of sense. On do you? Well, do you, do I still play Unity. I when I beat it, and they release the nine gigabyte freaking patch. Yeah, I, I haven't had that. Problem. My PlayStation Four because it's installed on. Hey, my how big was the last uh, update for Hyrule Warriors for you? <laughs> Megabytes. <laughs> Squares. <laughs> <laughs> blocks. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll give you that. But my PlayStation forced me to uh, download that patch because it was installed in my hard drive. Right, and that's what I'm saying. But I haven't put it in yet. I don't know how it runs now because I haven't that, put it that's in. That's fine, but th this is what no. I'm gonna give it. Uh, no, you made a lot. Of, I wasn't even thinking of that. Yes. Games that were coming out in the last fall that I was excited about that ended up like Unity really upset me. Yeah. Obviously with its yeah, bad it glitches. Did. I love Assassin's Creed mm -hmm. and Unity pissed in my mouth. Now yes, Nintendo does pissed not in a lot of people's mouths. Nintendo doesn't rush their games. And no, that's if you want a Zelda game, umbrella. you're fucking waiting now, for it. Now, and there's a reason for your waiting. It will be done. It will look good, and it will play. Right. Now, as long as it's not Twilight Princess and I have to be a dog half the fucking game. <laughs> I beat Twilight Princess and I'm sorry, but screw Skyward Sword. I don't like the dog. I never even played Skyward Sword. I'm going to admit it because it's I hated gimmicky. It's gimmicky, I hated but Princess on the that Wii much. U, on, the, on the Wii U with the Motion Plus, I enjoyed my experience a lot more than I did on the Wii. On the Wii, it was buggy as shit. Like... It, it worked, it w but it was weird. It was like the motion controls weren't ready. Yeah, it wasn't. And the whole game, to be fair, that's not, that's for once, that's not their fault. The entire game was built on the controller. Yeah. And at the last minute... They threw in motion controls. They demand, yeah, the company demanded motion controls. But, and it was like, but we're not ready for motion controls. And they were like, just just figure it out. But to be, but like you were saying... So it was a last when you minute quoted, addition. When you, when you quoted Shigeru Miyamoto... Mm -hmm. that I, I do I, I do like what they uh, did. Like the new Witcher game was supposed to come out in February. They pushed it back till May to make sure it we're not. Having... I would I would rather wait for a game than play something. When I when I heard the news today, it's not ready. I read something yeah, today. Right. I read something today that I didn't I liked and I didn't like because I have no patience. But I get when you. I when, when I brought up the new Uncharted game. It has now been pushed back till next year to make sure that they get everything correct. Good. But because because it is a PS4 exclusive, they've only got one console to work for. Yep. It will look great. It will be able it will play yep. to the controller. That's another thing that's important. Sometimes when they cross platform these and games, one controller works better than the other controller. Like and I'm gonna bring up one more game that I, when it was supposed to come out last year that they pushed back till June. Batman. They push back Batman to make good. Batman's coming out for the Xbox One and PS4. It will look good. And, it, and, I, and you know, when the other Batman games came out, I didn't run into any really bug. I didn't run into any major problems. I ran into one in Arkham Asylum. They're far and few and between, though. It, now, it was so bad that I had to restart my yes, game. Yes, you got stuck in something, didn't you? Uh, no, I punched somebody and Batman's arm disappeared. Yeah. <laughs> now, to be fair, Batman was running around like this. <laughs> And he literally had no arm on his skeleton, so he would do the motion for the punch, but unless his shoulder hit them, they were just like, stand there. <laughs> yeah. That's now, awesome. But well, like, but see, the biggest then I, I thought my bug was bad. I, I was trying to get all the Joker teeth, Look, and nobody I realized has I ever left had... one inside uh, nobody after has... Poison Ivy's shit got through. And all of a sudden, the Joker teeth were gone, but it said... The we can talk about... Well, none of you guys yeah. have had to deal with Savior Spock. He died for Kirk's sins. Now, when you... like you, Spock, and, and we were playing the game, and he, like... Was it you? Who was I playing with? It might have been... No, it was, it was Nick. Nick jumped as Spock. And Spock, all of a sudden, stood up straight like this. And just <laughs> flew around the fucking... <laughs> he did, he wouldn't, for the whole level, for an hour and a half, he just followed behind Kirk. <laughs> Crucifix Spock just followed Kirk the whole level. Please tell me you got really good into that. No. Uh, uh, no uh, uh, now, great. going back, that is a huge bug. <laughs> <laughs> and, it's a little game, right? Playing... playing <laughs> 
playing these new games. But to be fair, I'll never forget Crucible. You are, Spots, you so are right. You are right about something, Bill. I don't run into problems with the Wii games. Oh, and I'm gonna keep, know, I'm gonna keep bringing funny. it up because, like Spencer said, it broke my heart what happened to Unity. That was probably the buggiest game that I have played in recent years. Because when I played online, I jumped off the uh, off a, a building to land on this little uh, tent thing. And when I landed, I jumped down. It was like maybe five feet. I jumped down, went through the map. Now you could say I'm being, stuck. You could say we're being too critical here, and we're attacking. We're using one game to attack an entire system. But to be fair, this, this isn't is the a only big game. fucking target. Yeah, this isn't the <laughs> only game that this is happening. Halo with. Master Chief. Like, had think issues. about yep. think about how many games online are coming service out. problem. Think about how many games that are coming out at weird resolutions, like 900p. At 30 frames a second. Like I just brought like, up the new hard line. Like weird yeah. stuff. Like they're, they're finding My. ways to buggy stuff. Well, they're like well, Hyrule Warriors. I'm almost 100% sure. Keep going. I'm almost 100%. I can't find All right, it. While you're case. looking at that, my PlayStation 4, another bug I just thought of that kind of fucked me. Uh, WWE 2K15. I play every wrestling game when it comes out every year. Love okay. it. All right? You're yeah, like, you're, you do that what I do with Madden. Yep. So I'm playing... The career mode. And I get to the NXT Championship match. Yeah. I get knocked down. All right, I climb up onto the ropes. Now, keep in mind, my character is a super heavyweight, so <laughs> I shouldn't be up here. Yep. Adrian Neville pushes me to knock me down. My character falls, hits his nuts on the turnbuckle. Neville rolls me off. I have no damage. Neville rolls me off. Kicks my leg, my character starts spasming out, and I instantly had red damage my whole body. Wow. <laughs> From a stump. My dude's like, <laughs> I that's fucking had an epileptic seizure in the ring. That's one hell of a stomp there. Yeah. <laughs> I lost championship match against Adrian Neville from... Defeated. So... Which is funny, because I was actually just... Ah, it's something for off the podcast. <laughs> we don't want to hear about your sex No, oh, I, I was talking to Scott about a... A, in a, a wrestling game? Day of Reckoning. Okay. It was always funny, because you could make a character and then set it to ultra heavyweight, so they couldn't pick you up. But because there wasn't the stamina meter at the time, you could literally be, like, running and spearing them and then backing up, running and spear yeah. and then backing up, running and spear. Just be like, go oh, fuck yourself! Right. You stay dead! The, uh... The Hyrule Warriors, it's like I said, it's 1080p. It okay. runs 60 frames a second. <coughs> I every now and then in Hyrule Warriors, I can ex I can expect a little bit of slowdown, but especially if you're playing it just on the gamepad, it's never game breaking. Yeah. And the gamepad to make up for it, if you switch it to the gamepad, it drops the resolution to maintain the frame rate. Yep. Now, um, nice. but like we were saying. No. Um, now only Bethesda you, could figure when, out when a way you're to doing, do that. When you're doing the Mario Kart, <laughs> yep. when you're doing the Mario games, and these are okay, you just just to, just to even jump away from the Nintendo like, don't things. Don't get me wrong, I let's talk about games, that even games off. like oh, Resident Evil hours Revelations. And all of a sudden, <laughs> Resident Evil Revelations Vegas. is the same thing. Glitch Vegas. <laughs> it looks oh, great uh, and it works well. And to be oh, fair, let's Vegas, say that your system, Skyrim. let's say your system isn't that strong. I went out and bought Oblivion again. Let's fall back. Let's fall back and remember some of our history here the playstation 2 was still trying to maintain its market against a superior console the xbox i don't like the xbox in terms of what my two favorites there are but resolution the duke the oh. xbox was one of the first things ever for us for our consoles to be hd there were hd cords for the xbox yep like, if you played Soul Calibur 2 on the Xbox... It was 40p. It was shockingly amazing compared to the other games. But... I, I played Soul Calibur 2 on the GameCube first. PlayStation yep. knew something. They knew that if your system wasn't strong, then the next best thing to guarantee the visual power of your system was to play to its strengths. Now, now look at Soul Calibur 2 across all three systems... I played them on all three. The best looking one was the Xbox. Is the Xbox, but Spawn. Look at Soul Calibur three. 
PS2, it looked great. Why did it look so good? They changed the art style to match the power of of the PS2. So that they knew exactly no. what worked. Now, the the Wii U, just to keep my argument here on your graphics front to make you think before you plug down your grade here, they know that they are not as strong as the Xbox or the new PlayStation. I'm not sure which of those Asian dudes said it, but I'm pretty sure it was Miyamoto because he's, like, synonymous with Nintendo. He said... All of these people are worried about graphics. What happened to people worried about playing the game? Right. Now, Nintendo knows what it's capable of. So the games play right. And, graphically, they chose to... Out of all three systems... They chose to be left behind. No. Guess which one of the system has the best shaders? Yes, you did tell yeah. me that. The, the, the Nintendo... The Wii U has the best shaders of all three systems. So color scheme-wise, the Wii U is ahead of the curve. Their, their games, yeah, their games they are they always literally so took, colorful. Yeah, yeah they, they literally took the GameCube graphics, put it on the Wii, and then built around the graphics. They don't have, they don't have the, um, they don't have the resolutions, the power that the other two systems have, but because of the shaders, they're producing games that look so aesthetically pleasing by their art choices that yes, Okami, they can't create, they can't create, that's a pretty game. They can't Mm -hmm. create like a lifelike image. Like what? Okay. Soon. Soon, the two systems are going to leave the poor Wii U behind. It's going to happen. Mm-hmm. We're not talking about soon yet. We're talking about right now, if you buy these systems, what is using its capabilities? And soon, you're going to see games like the new Silent Hill. The Wii U cannot do that. Have and you seen will not do that. screenshots from that game yet? No. <coughs> Norman Reedus is in Silent Hill. The new one. Oh, Daryl! And he looks... And he looks like Darryl. Norman Reedus. Well, it's no question. When you're looking at is. that, again... Oh, now, I, that's the I'm basing, I'm basing this on the video, because I did watch a high... So, I did watch a high-definition video for that new Final Fantasy demo. Mm-hmm. Oh, my God. Now that me and... Now Behe- that, the behemoth in that game? Now that I've given you a second to think about this, and really you got to think about this... I am going to change, but I'm going to let... But I want to Who bring are a, you putting in first, second, and third? I'm putting... First off, I'm pulling... Who, who, all's, who all here is putting whatever in third? What's in third? Xbox. Microsoft. Xbox. Xbox. Ouch. The Sega Genesis. Microsoft <laughs> just got butt-fucked hard. Uh, PlayStation number two, and then I'm yep. going to... We wins it all. But before we do this, I'm going to bring you at. Hold on. He, he, did, he did the same two. thing. He did the same. We're on number two. Let, him, let everybody do their vote. Scott, go ahead. Now, are we still going back to second the graphics? Place. Yeah, we're on graphics. Just for graphics. I, I'm sticking with, 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 with what I said, with PS2 first and Wii U second. That's okay, just my so opinion. Okay, so you're a Wii U second place. Yeah. Where are you at? Sadly, it's too close for me to even tell. PS4 second like, place. I like player. the fact that the PS4 actually does have the graphical PS4s. capabilities, so that way then, it can, you know, with the Blu-rays and everything, Three P- no, I can still watch PS4 it. On first. But at the same yeah. time, Two the problem is, is, yes, the GameCube has that, or not the GameCube, sorry, the Wii U has that ability, where even though... It's not 99 anymore. Shut up, I know. <laughs> okay. I had a retard moment. Where, where, where are you at? I'm out of coffee. you got, you got to pick a second place. Fuck. Everybody jump Microsoft to third place in an instant. Yeah, I know, but that's that didn't even show, take thought process. The coin of that was that was uh, that was that was too easy. Does Seth require the coin of destiny? I'm I'm gonna have to go with Scott. Uh, I'm gonna put uh, PlayStation Wii U first, second. Wii U second. Yeah. Now you're the tiebreaker, Bill. What are you putting at number two? Wii or PlayStation? <laughs> For right now, and this is only right now, I will, I 100% want this to be understood. I believe the PlayStation, within a year's time, will take first place. But right now, those games are not here. You cannot buy them today. And for what's available right now, the best looking system on the market is the Wii U. 